Yo, what is going on guys? It is your boy Slate. Welcome back to once again another video here on the channel. Today is episode one of my brand new Skyblock series here on Nebridgecraft. My server, literally my, like actually my server. I'm the only owner, boys. So before anything, just make sure to put that IP in the multiplayer server list. Play it up, Nebridgecraft.com and uh, join up and check out the server because I know y'all are going to want to after you watch this video. So as you can see right now, we got a little island going. Now, as y'all know, I am the owner. So we do have IS top payout which is pretty good it's about 220 paypal throughout the season and 55 paypal a week so it's a four week map um so you know the paypal payouts are really good but of course since i am the owner i will be playing but i'm not going to be playing competitively because that just that just wouldn't be fair if i was to win the payout you know but yeah this is basically the island nothing crazy i'm going to be kind of showing y'all a lot of the crazy custom features that everyone that I've logged on to the server has loved and then before all of that we're actually gonna be opening an Easter crate the limited time crate because as y'all know when you're watching this video it is Easter so happy Easter to everyone hopefully y'all had a, a good day but uh gonna go and show off the Easter crate which is probably one of the best things on the server at least that's what everyone has said that has bought them so show off one of those and now we're actually gonna be giving one away in this video so all you gotta do is put in your name in the comment section leave a like on this video and subscribe to the YouTube channel to uh you know have a chance to win one of these bad boys so yeah we're gonna go ahead and open this three two one bang here we go now there's no sound on this little ringing part but at the end there is i think we're gonna add some but uh these are really freaking overpowered so let's see what we can get come on give me something good okay grinder g get easter pick oh my gosh yo that's actually really good. Okay, so we kind of need to decipher our stuff from the stuff we just got. So the Grinder G kit, which is really freaking good. I'm actually going to store that in my Ender chest. This is basically all the, uh, you know, admin items, I guess you could say, that I'm going to be giving away, um, you know, in my streams that I do here on the server, which I do very frequently. Got six rare keys. I'll take it. 15 villager spawners. That is... That's actually insane. That's really freaking good. And then a tier 5 gold money pouch. Let's see how much money we get. Okay, 905k. Not too bad, boys, but uh, that's the Easter crate. Um, and yeah, we're now going to hop into the rest of the video. If you enjoy, make sure you have a like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, let's get right into this. All right, so hopping right into this video, I want to show y'all kind of one of the main ways to start out here on the server. So if you do slash farming shop or just do slash shop and go to the farming shop area, as you can see, we got a little tier system going here on the server. So basically, the best crop to uh, harvest and stuff would be sugarcane. And, uh, you know, you don't actually get access to that right off the rip. So uh, basically, you'll get access to farming. I mean, what am I saying? You'll get access to carrots and uh, then you'll get to potatoes. So as you can see, to unlock potatoes, harvest 25. 500 carrots and uh, you know we've already done that so 100% so I can actually click in there and all that and buy potatoes which is what we're at right now and then so in order to get to pumpkins which will be the next tier I have to harvest 2500 potatoes so as you can see we got a little potato farm going right here I'm gonna make sure this is auto collect and uh, this is kind of what you do you just harvest it up and then uh, we the the uh, pretty much harvester hose we provide here on the server and get started you actually get a harvester hoe and a never sell one upgradable so if I go ahead and right click this sell one uh, you know, you can upgrade it up to uh, 1.75, which is really good. But uh, yeah, you pretty much get these, um, you know, once you spawn in, they're, uh, ax they're you know, they're, they everyone ha on the server has access to them, basically. But uh, yeah, this is kind of what we've been doing for farming. We need to get up to hopefully sugarcane soon so we can start making the max amount of money, you know, a player technically can be making. But uh, yeah, that's uh, basically how the farming is working. All right, boys, so now I am at Slash Spawn, and I want to show off, you know, a few more things just bef before we hop into the main sections of the video. But as you can see, this is spawned really nice. But if you go to this little corner, as you can see, it is the mine warp area. You can do Slash Warp Mine, or you can hit this little portal. It'll teleport you. Okay, as you can see, we're here at the mine. And basically how this works is once you, uh, you know, you start in the coal area. Once you've broken 500 coal, which you can check by doing Slash Broken, as you can see, this little GUI, you can then go into this section. Now, I am opt i'm owner on the server as you already know so i can go into this section and all that but i'm gonna limit myself to this coal and i'm gonna grind up legit and try to play as legit as possible as normal players actually get but i'm going to show the mine so you then go to iron and it's kind of the same way all the way through and the last section area is emeralds and emeralds are really good for is top for selling and all that so you know we're kind of grinding up we just got to grind here coal you know break 500 and then boom we can go to the next mining section
auction and uh, that's kind of how mining works now we are using this super overpowered easter pickaxe now there are custom enchants if i do slash enchants here on the server there's not a lot but they're uh you know they're kind of like potion enchants so you can get haste to telepathy auto mine or auto smelt on your pickaxe which is really helpful and uh, they also do come with g kits as you can see we got a miner g kit slayer g kit and grinder g kit so those are really good and those will uh you know pretty much deck you out if you get those um you know in gear okay and the last thing i want to make sure i show off in this video is the mob arena so you can get here by doing slash warp mob arena and this is actually really cool this is new from beta it's like a whole new feature for map one so basically when you kill these bad boys they have drop chances of giving you either skulls um or money basically at the moment we're going to be adding a lot more we'll actually be adding it where they drop shards as well and shards will then work with cell portals which will be releasing probably they'll be released when you're watching this video also but let me go and kill up a few of these mobs or custom mobs and uh you know oh my gosh come on what is my luck right now basically they drop items i'm gonna get one i don't know why i'm not getting one i might steal this guy did i get one dude what is my luck right now okay let's see if we can kill this one maybe these two one of these two after there you go we just got a head um and i picked it up which is good so basically i got the common boss skull with and there's actually three boss skulls you can get there's common rare and legendary and with these skulls you can actually do slash boss shop or you can do slash shop and uh, you know click boss shop here but you can change or exchange the heads into actual bosses so as you can see okay this zombie let me just go ahead and do slash spawn so i can get stop getting hit but if i go ahead and do slash shop again go to the boss shop as you can see you can exchange 10 boss 10 common boss heads for a common boss so this is basically how you get bosses here on the server and next clip i'm actually going to show y'all the common boss because people are saying bosses are super overpowered which they are you can literally win so much stuff and they're pretty easy to actually get so of course there's a you know common boss rare boss and the legendary boss which is really hard to get but uh yeah that is kind of how the mob arena and the bosses work also um in the mob arena probably as i said like literally a minute ago um we'll probably be adding shards that also drop the from the mobs uh, which would then you know work with the cell portals we'll be adding in all right, so we're back at the island, and I'm sorry for kind of hopping everywhere on the server. I just want to make sure I show off everything I want to. But basically, we did get those villager spawners from, where are they? Slash EC, I'm pretty sure, right? Yeah, we got these 15 villager spawners from the Easter crate at the beginning of the uh, video. So as you can see right here, we got chunk collectors here on the server. You know, you can get them pretty easily. If you go to the admin shop, you can buy one for $7 million and five hundred thousand dollars which is not very expensive because this is op skyblock so get one of these and uh, they're really good you know you can pretty much sell all the items so as you can see we literally just sold this like a minute ago we've already made 400k so click and there we go we got 400k you can also use your sell ones on them so if i was to upgrade this actually i probably can so let me do upgrade there we go upgrade there we go okay there we go so we have a 1.75 uh, sell one which is you know almost the best you can actually get a two times sell one from uh, you know crate keys um, supply drops just a bunch of stuff on the server so they're not that hard to get but uh, you know you kind of gotta play a lot to actually get them so you can pretty much shift and click this bad boy and it'll sell them for double so I'm guessing there was or not double 1.75 because I have a 1.75 uh, sell one but as you see we only have to are not only I mean that's a lot I actually thought we only had two we have 27 because someone on my island shout out to you but his username and let me do such is list I forgot how to pronounce it. okay it's like R E C T on retro Retaunt, retaunt, I'm not gonna try. Okay, but basically, he went, uh, you know, he donated a lot of Easter crates and stuff. So, shout out to you, man, if you're watching this video. But, gonna go and place these 15 villager spawners. Shift click. There we go. Now we have 42. Dude, we're gonna be making so much money. Oh my gosh. Like, I don't think y'all realize how much money we're gonna be making. We just doubled the spawners almost. If I click this, holy crap, already 171k. Okay, that is OP as crap, the villager spawners at least. But, uh, the thing is, if I haven't showed y'all off, I do slash rank up. This is actually based on your island um so there's rank up tiers right so basically you can rank up to actually unlock the mythical spawners which is where the villagers come and play but so basically if i was to do slash shop right and if i was to go to the spawner shop you actually can't buy villager spawners because they're in the mythical shop they're like the best spawners and of course and ways to unlock this is you have to rank up your island which i'll show you how in a sec but since i won those from crates you actually can place them but if i do slash rank up as you can see it tells your rank up statistics so it counts off of blocks broken in warp mine only mobs killed in the marbrina and then fish caught and basically you can see how much uh, stuff you need to do in order to actually rank up so we're rank up one right now and in order to actually get to rank up two we need to mine 1500 more blocks kill 250 more mobs and catch 15 more fish and that is actually counted as the island so say you have a 10-man island which is the max amount of players you can have per island 
all 10 of those people worked on this you can literally get it so easily but uh you know it adds just a little bit of a grind um to the server which i really like all right boys so as you can see our xp we have 138 freaking levels so what we're gonna go and do is slash enchanter and we're gonna pop some tier 3 enchants that are really cheap so we'll actually be able to buy so freaking many like we'll literally be able to get a god set if we wanted to but uh as you can see okay there we go so 30 should be enough i'm just gonna go and spam it up and see what we get inquisitive 3 not bad okay springs 3 we want and it's a 91 percent rate nine percent destruction rate so we're actually gonna yolo it here on our boots bang we got it right wait did we get it we did let's go okay springs three on the boots we want to start making the god set now i know i'm only using p4 but what i might do is when i get a bite by the way i want to let y'all know that i'm actually going to be using like the phoenix rank so it's the second best rank so i'm not using never strength but i'm using the phoenix phoenix rank you know when i record and play so that pretty much gives me the p4 i'm breaking three but by next video i'll probably be able to combine um you know two p4 and breaking three gears into a p5 so it is better but as you see so springs three i'll take it health boost one not bad we want better though inquisitive three springs three again i'll take it springs three springs three um okay 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 so basically all these are not too good so i'm gonna go and tinker every single one of these so we can get some dust and then if we get a good book that does not have good percent uh chances or something we can just uh you know make that better so let's go and spam up this dust there we go we got oh my 13 um 15 1 and then 7 so that's really good to go and spam up these rest of the books there we go okay that's all of them so hard and two not good okay you know i'm gonna do such tinker and start clicking them if i don't want them so hard and two no springs two no inquisitive three no um hard and three yes but the percent rate this is so bad but we can actually upgrade that so springs three already have hard and three yes and that one's better but we also want hard harden on all of our gears so we're gonna keep both of them harden two no help is two no but that is a good percent um all these no okay then these no but actually i want to check something so go and accept these get all this dust if i do slash enchant i want to check what the max inquisitive is so it's level five okay so we do have level three we don't want that tinker throw that in there we go now spam all these up once again are you serious we almost just got all mystery dust from that. That's unfortunate. But now, as you can see, we want to go ahead and make this 100%. 94 should do it. Go ahead and slap on our boots. Bang. There we go. Now we got Springs 3, Harden 3. We just need speed on those bad boys. And uh, we'll keep this Harden book for now. Go ahead and put it in my PV3. But uh, for enchanting, okay, we could enchant more. I actually want to see if I do slash enchants one more time. I want to check it out. So what do we really want? We want speed, I think. So speed and strength are, okay, so we get them from tier 2 book so we actually want to go ahead and buy some tier two books so if i do slash enchanter we're going to spam up some tier two books as you can see your little spam action we'll buy like 20 or 19 is good whatever i clicked f1 on accident my bad but spam these up give me a speed two give me a speed two please maybe wait i see a stacked book so we're gonna do slash tinker again here we go okay featherweight three holy crap that's good and that's gonna go on my april sword that we got from the monthly crate that's really good wow okay telepathy one i'll take it we can put that on the april pickaxe um speed two not the best rates but still good skin of the nether we need featherweight two no skin of the nether better percents as well gonna go and put that one up speed two really good percents let's go dude that's really good so we'll keep that speed two book and um, we got more telepathy and there's the same exact success and destroy rate how is that even happen? But we're actually going to keep these two telepathy books and throw this one up. Um, skin of the Nether, no. We already have one. Strength, no. Telepathy, no. Bad. Region 1, really good percent rates as well. Wow, that's good. Okay, I'll take that. Strength 2, do we even have a strength book? No, we don't. So we'll keep that for now. And then all of these, um, okay, wait, 99% rate of telepathy. Holy crap, that's good. So we're going to keep that one. Throw all these up. Okay, that should be enough. Now tinker these bad boys. And these are all the books that are really good. So I'm going to go and get speed first. So let me go ahead and spam up these. Um, just so, come on, give me luck. Okay, there we go. We got 4, 3, and 11. So the speed book, actually, we can use 11, which will get it to 98. And we're going to YOLO. Let's go. There we go. Okay, now our boots are literally maxed out, I think. Speed 2 and Harden 3, Springs 3. Dude, those boots are freaking god tier. Now, I want to get... No, we don't need Featherweight just yet. Telepathy on our pickaxe. We're going to go for that. There we go. We got Telepathy on our Easter pickaxe. That's actually really good. Um, now, we could get Region, which I'm pretty sure we want to put Region on a legging. So, YOLO. Here we go. There we go. We got region. Let's freaking go, boys. All right. Skin of the nether. We're going to yellow it. Three, two, one. Come on. Let's go, dude. That's huge. Oh, my gosh. All right. Now, we're going to use all of this mystery dust on the strength. And, boys, this is going to be a big yellow. Now, if it breaks my chest plate, it's not the end of the world because we already don't have anything on the chest plate. Now, 50 or 49 success, 50 destruction. So, it literally has a better chance of destroying the freaking chest plate, boys. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. All right. Here we go. Three, two, one. Please work let's go dude our luck oh my gosh we literally have like a full set going 
Oh my gosh. Okay. That's enough for now. Featherweight. Okay. Honestly, we're, we're in a good freaking mood right now. We're really rocking it. So let me go and grab my sword. Where is it? Sword Phoenix sword. We're going for it. Three, two, one. Bang. Let's do it. Did, did we even have one book that broke? I don't think so. What is our luck, baby? Let's go. So we are rocking it with haste on this. Oh my gosh. Let's freaking go, dude. That was really good. Um, now we literally almost have a full god set. Uh, already. Alrighty, boys. So, to end off this video, we're actually going to be opening a legendary crate. So, bang. Here we go. Let's see what we can get. But again, thank you to everyone. If you have made it to the end of the video, tell me in the comment section because I appreciate you a lot. But, uh, 500k, not too shabby. I'll take it. We could have got better. Uh, but, you know, we'll work with what we got. If we would have got a premium set one or some chunk busters or even a rank, that would be freaking sick three for some spawners or three more legendary keys oh my gosh that would have been sick but yeah if you have not yet joined the server what are you freaking doing play.neverscraft.com is the server ip so get your booty in here boys um but yeah i will see you guys in the next video make sure to check out the server and peace out